Hi guys, today I'm going to be doing a review slash demo and what I am going to be reviewing here is the Benefit Bail Real Push-Up Liner and basically this is a gel eyeliner in a pencil or a pen form. So I thought this was very interesting because there's nothing like this on the market. There's a lot of felt tips and there's brush tips but nothing quite like this. This is not even like sponge. This is kind of like... Um, it feels kind of rubbery, but basically it's just a like rubbery tip with a sharp little angle on the edge or on the very top. And uh, basically you just twist right here on the bottom and the gel comes out through there. I find that you just need to click about one to two times and that should be enough for your entire eye if you are... If you're a beginner, you might end up having to use a little bit more, but only because when I use it, I have a little bit more control and I know pretty much how to do my eyeliner. But if somebody doesn't know, then they might have a little bit more trouble and end up wasting a little bit more product than you need to. But a little bit goes a very long way. This is just about two clicks and as you can see, it is pretty dark and you could get some pretty small little uh, lines so okay I'm going to show you a quick demo on how I apply my eyeliner using my push liner from Benefit I found a lot easier to work on the base of my lashes and just make sure that it's perfectly dark and uh, perfectly covered and you don't want any skin peeking through so you just want to uh, build the intensity and gradually just push your brush up to create a thicker line. So once you have the thickness that you want you want to create a wing so now you want to hold your pen with the pointy side facing your ear and basically you're just going to let the shape of the pen do the work. This is what it was designed for. Uh, so. So it's up to you on how far you'd want to take your eyeliner and how thick you'd want to do it. But once you have the general eyeliner look that you want, so now you want to draw a straight line with the very tip of the pen from the end of your waterline to the very top of the wing. And that is it. That completes the perfect cat eye. I actually was very surprised. I didn't think that it was going to be this easy to use because I am so used to eyeliners and um, brushes that I figured that this was just going to be a little bit bulky and it was going to be hard for me to use and get used to, but it was very easy. It feels exactly the same as just using a uh, gel uh, pot and a brush. So that's pretty much what I use. I think gel is a little bit easier to use than liquid but only because it doesn't glide on as smooth as a liquid does. So I know it's not necessarily a bad thing. It's just I feel like it gives you more control. Sometimes when I use liquid I kind of overdo it because it's just so slippery that it's hard for me to have control and this was very easy to use. I had perfect control and the tip is perfect. It allows you to create a very sharp wing so I really like that about it. I have no complaints so far. Anyways, I want to read you a little bit of what the box says. So. Okay, so this is long wearing, waterproof, and it is very long wearing and waterproof. It's very, very hard to take off. I can't even take it off with my normal, you know, whatever I used to take off my entire face because normally I only use one to two products, mainly just one product to clean my face. I kind of just grab something and put it all over my face and that I want something to take off my face foundation and my eye makeup but with this I had to use something a little bit better like a eye makeup remover so it is very very long wearing and waterproof just like it says so it says it hugged the lash line and makes eyes look visibly larger so I mean just like any eyeliner would do make your eyes appear a little bit larger and I don't know about hugging the lash line I'm not really sure what that means and um, so on the back it says beyond easy to get bigger sexier eyes the first ever lash hugging gel liner pen the custom AccuFlex I'm guessing that's what the little thingy that's the name of it um, tip hugs your lash line for bigger looking eyes in seconds. I don't like the term hugs. I don't know what that means. It just it hugs your lash line. It's, I don't know, stupid. 
Um, where was I? The closer the line, the bigger the eyes. Okay. Okay, so on this side it says, oh, it talks a little bit about the tip. So this is called the Acuflex, Acuflex Tip. Custom soft angled tip gets the matte black smudge proof line close to your lash line. Um, okay, and that's it. Sure, I don't know about hugging your lash line, but it definitely works really good. It gets right on the lash line. I guess that's what they mean, but I don't like the term hug. Um, so it does, you do, you are able to get it as close to your lash line and um, that is all I used, you know, like sometimes I have to just really smudge my eyeliner right in between my lashes, but this actually did a very good job of getting right there and, and that is all I used. I seriously thought that I was going to have to go in with something very tiny, something like, I thought I was going to have to go in with something like this, which is a very, very small little detail um, eyeliner brush which I normally use sometimes I just use something like so what I normally use lately has been my mint 26 brush which I absolutely love to do my eyeliner and it's it's not that it's similar in shape but it does have a very sharp tip and it's very flexible just like a brush it's I love that it's flexible and it was just I was really surprised honestly like I didn't have to go in with any of my brushes to clean up any edges this worked perfectly I didn't even have to uh, twist too much product out I felt like I only twisted about one product and I was able to do my line and then um, twist a little bit more to sharpen everything and to just kind of finish everything off so it didn't require a lot of product at all I was very happy because sometimes things like this are very wasteful in my opinion that's why I just always preferred a little pot and eyeliner brush so so overall I really liked this product I really liked that somebody came out with something different it's not a copy of somebody else's product they're just trying to make it better or anything it's their original product and it works perfectly it's long wearing it's easy to use it's super black and super matte and it was just it was took me by surprise i did not think that it was going to be this easy to use and i didn't think that i was going to like it as much as i do so i really recommend this i would give this product about an 8 out of a 10 which is really good the only thing that i would say is that um it doesn't have a lot of product in it it only contains about um 0.04 ounces 0.04 ounces like something like this that you this is my Maybelline New York eye studio and this contains 0.106 ounces so as you can see it's a huge difference um, the only thing you know I don't think that this is waterproof but um, honestly like I've never when I wear makeup I never think that I am going to go out and just wet my entire face and body like usually I'm pretty good at uh, keeping my face dry so um, I don't know I mean I guess if you want to go out to the pool or something and have your eyeliner looking perfect then this would be a good product for you but overall I really like it and I would definitely recommend it so I think that is pretty much it I don't have anything else to say I don't have anything negative so I really like the product and I really hope you guys liked this review if you guys have any other uh, products you would like to see me review please leave them down below and I really hope you guys enjoy this and I'll talk to you guys soon